Hi everyone, uh, Holanda here from Master Sculpture. Um, I want to make this quick video over here. Well, I'm gonna try to make it quick. But it's more edu uh, educational clip video for those who are trying to hire a coach. And when I say coach, uh, prep coach, um, bodybuilding, physique, figure, and so forth. Now, uh, I'm not trying to do anything to hate anything or anything like that. It's just more educational for those who are searching, looking for a real coach out there. Now, uh, as you know, there are tons of coach nowadays. There's coaches everywhere. They just came out of the blue and everybody's a coach now. This is not about that. This is kind of to educate you who you should be hiring and uh, the questions you should have when you hire a coach. And at the end of this clip, I actually gonna give you names of other coaches that I that I trust and I believe in it. First thing you wanna think about when you're hiring a coach is their experience. You wanna say experience, how long have they been doing that? I would say a safe time frame is about five years, 10 years at least. Uh, experience and knowledge, knowledge comes experience. Experience comes with time. And uh, the longer that coach been coaching, the more experience you're gonna have, the more knowledge you're gonna have. So that's foremost, one of the most important things you should be considering. Uh, another thing too is their proof, what they have to show you that they are a successful coach. Look at the before and after pictures, their clients, his or her clients. How long they've been doing those, the, 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 taking care of those clients for. Question their clients. Um, meaning, uh, make sure that they have a diverse numbers of different coaches, uh, uh, different uh, uh, clients. Now, also with that said, make sure that their coach also has put any type of competitor on the stage. When I say that, figure, bikini, bodybuilding, physique, the more knowledge and diversity he has with different body types, the more that coach is going to be able to figure out what is the best, the best uh, uh, training for yourself. So keep that in mind as well. Uh, one thing you got to keep in mind as well, find a complete coach. When I say complete coach, a coach that who will give you everything that you need from A to Z, meaning nutrition, dieting, cutting up faces, uh, diet down, carb cycling, uh, uh, training, you know, how to put muscle mass, how to take body fat percentage off, training, posing. Somebody's gonna also teach you how to pose, not only for bikini, for figure, for bodybuilding, everything. So, because you have to hire somebody else no matter what. If one coach cannot give you all, that means you're spending more money than somebody else. So you don't want to be caught up what I call the triangle of hate. When I say triangle of hate, first you spend the money, find a coach gonna take care of your diet. You find another coach to take care of your training. And you find another coach to teach how to pose. Now, these three coaches might not agree with each other. And what happens? They all disagree with each other. And who's in the middle of everything? You, you're in the triangle of hate. So think about that too. Uh, that's what I mean about complete coach. Uh, one more thing, full-time. Not necessarily means it has to be a full-time coach, but make sure that this coach will be able to be available for you at least full-time. Most of the time, there are coaches out there who does this for a living. In my opinion, those you should hire. Why? Because that's all they do. So if you, if you, fire, if you hire somebody who's a full-time coach, most likely, most likely you're gonna get a full-time answer and a very fast answer rather than wait three, four, five days to uh, get a uh, response. Um, one more thing too. Ask about reverse diet. The coach who doesn't know, doesn't know anything about reverse diet, run away for your life. Why? Everybody's gonna tell you, oh, let's do a show, it's perfect, let's do a show, it's great, it's the best thing ever. It's not. It's not something easy to do, it's not something fun to do. It takes hard work from everybody. But make sure somebody's gonna teach you how to reverse diet, and what I also like to call reverse output. How that coach can bring you back to normal life. Because if you don't do that the right way, you will 
it will cause your metabolism damage. You might play with the thyroid and it might have a problem that you might suffer in the end of it. Um, so keep in mind all those questions. Ask the right questions too. Who am I? What body type do I have? A good coach will diagnose you, meaning they're gonna find out what body type you have. So there they can design the right training, the right diet, the right routine for you. Um, I the type of person that requires to see my clients every week. Every single week I have to train them, I have to see them visually. I have to see them visually to see their progress. It's one thing for you to send the pictures and something else for you to see your client moving in the front of you. So think about that as well. Now let me tell you several names that I trust. I have respect for these guys and I hope they have the same respect for me. And a good coach never gonna really bad mouth other coach. They have mutual respect. And that's what I have through my co-workers, co uh, co-coaches. Uh, co Billy Murphy, uh, John Yobisht, Yobisht, sorry buddy. Uh, Glenn Rodriguez, uh, Ken Johnson, Robert Castarelli. These are guys who have been around, for, I'm sorry to say it myself, I've been here for around 16 years. Those are all guys who are coached themselves and also bodybuilders themselves, competitors. And they have proven that they're good coaches. And I like to throw my name out there as well, if you don't mind, if you don't mind saying. Uh, I want to leave you with one thing, one knowledge so you can understand. And think this way. If you were going to have a heart, uh, open heart surgery, okay? If you're going to have an open heart surgery, who would you hire? A doctor who has been doing open heart surgery for 10, 15 years with successful outcomes? Or are you going to hire the nurse we just learn how to do stitches. Yes, that's your health. Think about that. This is not a joke, guys. It's about your health. It's not gonna be easy. It's not gonna be going to be easy. It's going to be hard. It's gonna take a lot of work from you and from your coach. And one final thing that will leave this, and I'm sure all the coaches that I mentioned about gonna agree with me. Listen to your coach. Whatever you hired, I don't care. Whatever you hired, listen to your coach. That's what you pay them for. Because if they make a mistake, and if you're doing what they ask you to do, they will fix it. However, if you not listen to your coach, no matter who you hire, guys, it's not gonna happen. So anyhow, I hope this is gonna help some of you guys. If it doesn't help you, send to a friend of yours who might be looking for a coach. Uh, by the way, I'm gonna start my team in three weeks. Uh, the kickoff for the fall starts in three weeks. And uh, I hope to see you in the fall. I hope to see you on the stage and uh, be good to each other, be safe, and take care of each other. I hope this helps. Bye.